Okay, welcome. Here's your writing lesson for today. We are finally starting a new unit for writing. Um, our, our, what we're focusing on this time is personal essay. Before we did a, a narrative, an imaginative narrative, and now we're done with that. You guys did a really good job. Now we're moving on to a personal essays, okay? We are on 5.1. You are going to need this packet. It says understanding idioms on it, okay? It says draw and write a time when you had to stand tall. How did it make you feel? Now, we're not going to do that on here, not yet. Instead, we are going to brainstorm something. So, let's see. Let me grab this. All right. So, we're going to explore things that makes us unique. And we're going to write a personal essay about what, what makes us unique. And we're going to share it with others. Who knows what unique means? Nobody. Unique means special. What makes us special? What makes us different than everybody else? What's something that's about that we have that not everyone else has? Just think about that for a second. There are no two people that are exactly the same. And that, our differences, are what makes us special and unique, right? No one in here is the same as anyone else. Do you all agree? Yeah. Yes, we are all different. And that thing that's different between us all is what makes us special or unique. Let me give you an example, Haney. When I was in the second grade, I had brown hair that I wore in two long braids. My mother would tie a colorful ribbon to each of my braids. I had a matching set of ribbons for every dress. I was very tall, and people always asked me if I liked to play basketball. I did not. I liked to play soccer instead. What details tell you more about me? How could I show these ideas in a drawing? Hmm. We're going to do an all about me assignment. We're going to create a web on chart paper and we're going to write down ideas that answer these questions. So on your paper, uh, actually, you know what? I changed my mind. I don't want to do this. We're going to do the all about me, but we're not going to do it on this paper. Instead, I'm going to come around and pass out a piece of paper that I want you guys to do it on. And then I'll staple that paper onto this packet. Okay. So my onliners, you're going to get a separate piece of paper, and you're going to do the brainstorming on there. All right, you can pause the video now. All right, so back to our lesson. What I want you guys to do is on your paper, we're going to draw a map, a web, kind of like mine. So you're going to draw a circle in the middle, and you're going to write all about me, and then you're going to write your name. Are you writing my name? No. No, you're writing your name. All right. And then you're going to draw little lines on your web, and I want you to write things that are unique or special about you, okay? Unique or special about you. All right, I'll give you a minute to go ahead and write this down. Okay, so all about me, you're writing your name in the middle. Let's answer some questions. What do you notice about your hair? I want every... Excuse me. This is not something for you to answer out loud. This is something to write on your paper. Write details about your hair and maybe some of these boxes in some of these uh, circles. You can write one thing or you can write two things about your hair. Think about that. You can pause the video now. Okay, what do you notice about your eyes or your height? What color are your eyes, even if they are brown or black? Write it down. What do you notice about your eyes? Do you have long eyelashes? Okay. Are your eyes big? Are they small? What color are they? Write down what you notice about your eyes. Also, write down what you notice about your height. Are you tall? Are you short? Are you average? Write about your height. Write about your eyes. Pause the video now. Is there a game you play that you want to tell others about? Is there some kind of game that you like to play? Uh, 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 that, please don't share your ideas with everybody yet. Just go ahead and write down the things that you like to do, maybe. 
the games you like to play, things about you, things that make you unique. Go ahead and write those down. Pause the video now. All right, is there an activity you like to do? Like, do you like to help your neighbor? Um, is there any kind of activity you do that you want to tell others about? Maybe something maybe before COVID, some stuff that you used to do, maybe an activity you used to do before. Um, maybe some activity that you'd like to do or you'd like to be part of. Maybe you never have, but you really would like it. Go ahead and add that onto your web now. Pause the video. Okay, now before you move on, you need at least anywhere between five to 10 things about yourself. So you should have at least five. If you wanna add more up to 10, that's awesome. So you should have at least five to 10 things on your web that describe yourself. If you're having a hard time thinking of some things, think about things that you like to do. Think about things that you like in general. What are things that you like? Things that Think about things of like how you look. Maybe things that are unique about you that look a lot different than everyone else. Think about things that maybe colors you like to wear or designs you like to wear or things you like to wear. Okay, I need at least five to 10. Now when you're done on the back of your paper, you are going to draw a picture of yourself. When you are done drawing a picture of yourself, you are going to label the things in your picture about yourself. So for example, if I was, uh, if I had red hair, then I'm gonna color my hair red and I'm gonna label red hair. I'm gonna write a little arrow next to my hair and I'm gonna say red hair. If I have freckles or braces or curly hair, I'm gonna label all of that in my picture. If I like singing or if I like riding a bike, I'll probably draw a bike on there or me singing or me reading, okay? And you're gonna label each part on your picture. Okay, so make sure you add detail and color to your picture when you're done with your web. And that's all you're gonna do today for your writing. But please do keep in mind, um, our focus statement, which every person has unique characteristics. Every person is unique. All right? All right, have fun learning, and I'll see you later.